What's up guys, Maritime Spook here, and I just got a couple packs from our friends at Tactical Innovations Canada to show you. I've uh, been out with this 48 hour pack today, just on a jaunt, uh, trying it out, adjusting it to uh, the size that I need it at. And I can tell you guys, uh, favorite pack I've ever owned. I've only owned this for a few days guys, and it fits me great, and I have a bunch of weight in here. Probably too much stuff even for just adventures around, uh, but I'm getting back on the wagon as far as going to be working out again like I did last year, and uh, this is great to have some extra weight. And uh, <clears throat> this pack, this pack just rides so great, guys. I can tell you, beautiful waist straps on it, great sternum strap right there, and actually, uh, well, shoulder straps, I mean, and a waist strap that actually fits me with lots of room. I even have room I could tighten it more and I could pull it down to the waist but with the bulky jacket guys I like to wear my waist strap up right here and then it gives me that support and I can still access stuff in my jacket and it's not pulling around um, but I'm going to take this one off and show it to you and actually actually I'll keep this one on and I'll show you the 65 liter one right now that'll probably be easier uh, to show you this so been out all day walking with this one on guys just to get estimation of it and i really love it um this one here is a 65 liter pack some beautiful uh patches here by tactical innovations canada as well pvc patches got the new brunswick uh, flag and they have all the provincial flags that you can order uh canadian flag and uh, Canadian Freedom Fighter right there, which is super, super cool. Uh, there is Molly everywhere on this, guys. And this is your larger expedition type pack, guys. You can see, um, set up for, you know, long distance hikes and being out. And, uh, you know, being out for long periods of time and carrying weight over distance. Uh, very, very nice shoulder straps with a, uh, with a ladder right here. Uh, so what that is is that goes up onto these pieces of molly and you adjust it to your shoulder height and uh, Just adjust it the way it's most comfortable for you So that's a huge plus there guys because this this pack will fit pretty much anyone because you can adjust it to the size you want it um, Beautiful beautiful waist straps guys. It's got molly on the sides and like the 48 hour pack I'm wearing the waist strap fits me very well so you know if you're a big guy i can give you you know the go ahead to get these right now guys they will fit you they fit me great love them so lots and lots of molly on each side for different things you can mount your knives you can mount uh canteen cup sets and all the whole nine yards on there big grab straps here on each side with the molly and uh this all flips up and then you get into having a large drawstring here uh, with a huge pocket on the inside and that pocket is also accessible from the front you can pull that open and get in and get out your gear without having to unzip the whole thing and on the inside it has retention straps here so if you put your sleeping bag or a shelter or something in there you can strap it down and it's not going to move around in there so i have it loosened up just to show you but it flips over this is like a uh, material like a storm flat type material and this flips over and clips like so uh, with your id uh, slot there and also in the bottom this pulls open and right up in here is a rain uh, rain flap that goes over the whole pack so this also unclips and you can use this as a duffel bag so just very very innovative guys we're going to get into more comprehensive look at this pack um, but i just want to show it to you uh, it's got all kinds of uh, d rings on it uh, for attaching gear and carabiners uh, and same with the shoulder straps on here and why what who of these have been used by is a lot of police out west the red deer police department um red deer and I, there's a couple other ones guys they've ordered like 75 or 80 of these packs uh the 65 liter and the 48 
Uh, the 48 has been used by everybody from police to military personnel to wildlife officers. The one I'm wearing on my back and the same goes for this one. So as I said, 65 liters turned into a duffel bag or wear it as your expedition pack. So we're going to get into more comprehensive on that one guys, but I just want to show that to you really quick. I didn't fill that one up full of gear because that's going to be, you know, that's going to be expedition type bug out bag, you know, that type of bag. I'm going to put stuff that, you know, overnighter type stuff in that. This 48 hour pack has been more my um, everyday, we'll say adventure pack. So I'll unstrap this, but just great guys. Very, very comfortable. Same, uh, got the same pouch of patches on there. The uh, New Brunswick flag and Canadian flag, Canadian gunfighter. So there's a good spot there and a spot there for your pouch, uh, patches. Um, here's the front strap where you open this up and clip there and clip there. And then you've got this all right in here, guys, as an expandable uh, pouch. You could put a tactical helmet in there. You could put, you know, a whole bunch of stuff in the gear in there, guys, in between. And as you can see, it's got elasticity there. So it's got lots of, you know, you can pull it way out like this or have it sent straight up against you. On the panel itself, you can unzip it. And it's got an admin pouch in there with a place for a radio you know right in here with an elastic keeper for a radio slot in the back and all kinds of different pouches uh, for different things in there put your leatherman in here and just that's just right on the uh, expandable panel and then it's got another zipper right there in the front and tons of molly uh, on the front we got a zipper we got a zipper right here on the front that is uh, for like a camera equipment or you know like your sunglasses could go in here because it's all felt lined in there. Very very soft in the top part and then it has this very very large opening spot um, where I've got MREs and got all kinds of stuff. But I'm not going to get into all what's in it because that will be for the next video. So I want to show you how much stuff I can fit in this thing. So I'll strap that back up, but uh, got the Pathfinder canteen set mollied on the side. Very, very nice shoulder straps. Got my knife on, got a knife on there. Um, carabiner, D-rings, you know, your sternum strap or your whistles. Um, very, very nice padded uh, waist straps that actually fit a big fella. So, really love these guys. Uh, super, super thick uh, stitching, grab stitching and stuff on it. It's just great. And one thing I will say, guys, I went over both of these packs. And both packs, guys, they uh, wasn't like a stitch out of place. A lot of packs I've gotten, there'd be stitches. you got to burn them off or try to fix them. Nothing like that. These were immaculate, immaculate uh, stitched. And they're not even that expensive. Uh, for what you're getting and this uh, pack here is the one as I said I've been wearing uh, well two days now just out and about and I love it love it guys um, super comfortable uh, and as I said even for a big fella I've got I've got the waist strap accessible And, you know, away you go, even with 30-something pounds in it, guys, um, <laughs> I can't even tell I've got it on there. I would have no qualms with, you know, walking 10 clicks with this on the back, 20 clicks probably, because I don't even feel it's on there. And I, like I said, in the back of this, we'll get into what I have in it. I have all the 10 Cs plus redundancies in it. So that'll be some weight. I've got MREs, med kit, a whole bunch of stuff, guys, and I can barely even tell I have it on, so... Uh, anyway, guys, that was just a quick look at these two packs. Obviously not a review. I'm going to get out and use some more. Show you a loadout for each one. The next video, I imagine, will be a loadout for this 48-hour one. And then I'll pack the big 65-liter one 
with more like expedition uh, type of gear. So anyway, guys, I'm going to put a link in the description to Tactical Innovations Canada uh, and a link to their Instagram. Go over and check them out. They've got everything from those patches I showed you to the packs, breaching equipment for doors, headlamps, all kinds of uh, tactical and, you know, awesome gear. So anyway, guys, stay safe and stay tuned. That was just a quick look at this 48 hour and the 65 liter packs by Tactical Innovations Canada. Stay safe, guys.